Reggie White is usually on point with what he be saying. Now, we got to remember that Reggie is a former police. Uh, I don't know what rank he was, detective, whatever. I'm not sure. Uh, and he also was a former bodyguard for Death Row with all them blood niggas and Suge Knight and all that over there. So he got his ear in law enforcement office and he got his ears in the streets as well. Now, he made the last predictions on them arresting Diddy. Now, he lived in Los Angeles, and we know Diddy got homes in Los Angeles that got raided, uh, as well as in New York and, I believe, in another place, too. And uh, he predicted that. So, we just don't know what connections he got that's giving him the information that he's coming out with. Now, uh, he think that Diddy may pull a Russell. <laughs> he don't believe that Diddy is uh you know capable of standing on his own in court it came out that a grand jury may be convening uh to investigate the diddy allegations and possible charges against him did you hear about this and do you have any thoughts or a reaction to it, the news yeah y'all funny to me <laughs> y'all funny to me i told y'all what's going on what's going to be happening i didn't compare the donald trump situation when the grand when they went and did the search warrants grand jury uh, uh, was assembled and then they got indicted, right? I compared the Keefe D situation, did a search warrant, do a grand jury, indictment coming. Mm. I told y'all, what, four months ago when this all just broke? It wasn't four months ago. But I said four months ago, four months there will be an arrest done by Mr. Combs. I told y'all the reason why I said four months because of all the things that had to happen. The search warrant, which happened right after I said it was going to happen. And then the grand jury part, which is happening now. And it's the beginning of June 2024. Uh, I guarantee y'all by the end of August, by the end of August. I'm not saying he will be in custody because I believe he's going to either run like Russell or he's going to commit. I don't know, y'all. I don't know. My thing is, I feel like if he was going to run, I think he would have been dead by now. He would have did, he would have did it by now or he finna get ready to do it because he on the time clock because with the feds coming out on him, of course they gon they gon try to, they gon they gon they gonna charge him with something. They don't just go and raid people house and they don't end up charging him. We ain't really seen that happen. So he gonna get charged with something. I don't believe Puffy is the type of man that can set up and uh, go to court and uh, and try to fight this. Mm, I don't know. I mean, do y'all think he can sit up in there like Young Thug? Young Thug been sitting for two years now. It's tough in there. Just imagine being a billionaire. Now, Young Thug is a millionaire, but being a billionaire, literally getting anything that you want in this life at the snap of your fingers, literally, to having to go and follow orders of another person and live the way that they want you to live. I don't, I don't think he built for it either. Uh, uh, now court, I, I don't know, but he go to court. He got to he got to get he got to stand on something. <laughs> he got to stand on something. Either he going he going he going to take it to trial, win or lose. Got to stand on something. So, y'all think he going to take it down? I believe people going to advise him to do that because attorneys does that. They do that until until it's over and then they want to drain you and then once they get all the money they can make it. That's their job, you know. They that's how they make a living. So they put their kids through school, pay their secretaries and their side bitches, and you know, ride around the cars. So, yeah, they gonna drain him. Yeah, they gonna they, his lawyers definitely gonna they gonna do their job. That's for sure. Is this the the question is is he gonna let them do their job before he decide to do what he gonna do what we think he gonna do? But I don't. They gonna advise him or attempt to or want to do that. I don't think Puffy is strong enough to. Uh, Set in there, set in that that, um, that county jail federally. 
all the accusations and the way they've been making him the, the monster and, and all the tapes and stuff we done saw. That's the whole reason why they even came after him, I believe. It was just so much that was coming out to where they had to step in and say, man, we got to see what's up. We got to. It's just too much coming out. He's not going to be able to, uh, you know, get a bill. I don't care how much it is. Because he can come up with a $25, $30 million bill. He can. He can. And that's, and that's half of that. Well, 10% of that. So, of course, he can he can afford that. But but the thing would be, he's still a flight risk. Mm-hmm. And uh, still a flight risk. see, he already... He can go anywhere he want to go. He get that bond. He can go to Russell. He can go be with Russell if he want to. They can't touch him. Well, I'm pretty sure they'll put some restrictions on him as well as far as fleeing. I'm sure. But he can get that bond like it ain't nothing. Going into public pressure, he had a daughter. This is one of the happiest times of your life it was when your kids graduating from high school and, you know, being rich. Family time is is more important than anything with people. He seems and appears to love his kids. I'll give him that. His daughter graduated from high school last week. He couldn't go. He didn't go. Respectfully, respectfully, he didn't go. Okay. Because he know too hot. Well, he would have made a. It would have turned the high school graduation into a big spectacle. Too hot. So I, I I applaud him for bowing out and not going there. Yeah, that's tough. That's tough on any person to not go to their kid's graduation, you know, uh, because of your legal matters and your stardom too. You know, I'm pretty sure if he wouldn't didn't have all this going on, he would have appeared, I'm pretty sure. But with this cloud over him, it wasn't going to be good. But So you got to tip your hat for him making that decision. That's hard. But I'm just bringing up things like that to show that he's already starting to try to distance himself and understand that, okay, this shit is real. Why is he walking outside the gate at his house, y'all? Why is he doing that? He's trying to feel y'all, get a temperature, yeah. get a temp. Let's see where y'all head is. Got a picture of his daddy and him on a chain. <laughs> Trying to, to see where y'all y'all temperature, feel the temperature. Uh -huh. You know outside the gate is TMZ and um, Pasta Rossi, or however y'all say that word. He know that. You see he's talking about some love. <laughs> that nigga ignorant. And standing out there taking pictures. Photographers, I'll use the, 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 the old Hello, word. Hello, go back. Hello, look at him, y'all. And standing out there taking pictures. Photographers, I'll use the, 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 the you know outside the gate is TMZ and um, Pastor Rossi. Look at him. Love. Or however y'all say that <laughs> word. And standing out there taking pictures. Photographers. I'll use the, 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 the old name word. Photographers sitting outside taking pictures waiting to see. His property in his backyard is big enough where he can go and take walks. Facts. But he got to do that. That's a guy that's checking the temperature. Did y'all see his face? Did y'all see how he was looking? That's a man that's fearful. Oh yeah. Scared. Yeah. He definitely he definitely sweating for sure. That's for sure. Every day he probably is he probably barely even getting sleep. This man a billionaire possibly be locked away for a very, very long time. Puffy would never sit in no jail cell. Mm. Uh, I don't see it either. He's gonna either try to run or he going to go and meet his maker. He going to run. I don't see him. I don't, I don't see him. Uh, I definitely see him running way before I see him uh, taking his life. Of course. We don't think that he got it in him to be doing all of that. Take your life. I mean, I don't know. This this a lot of shit now. This shit, this some heavy shit. <laughs> you never know how how he may be stressing out up in the in that house, man. You never know, but you know I don't. He got he got all his kids. You know he got hella kids. He just had a newborn. You know that baby probably ain't nothing but 
I don't know, a year old, if that. So I don't see him taking his life. I definitely see him fleeing before I see him taking his life. That's for sure. Because the walls, they caving in right now. That's for, that's definite. And, ah, man, that southern, that southern district of New York, they don't, they, don't, they don't lose. You see how they did Trump. So you think they ain't going to stick it to him too? And others? So uh, we're gonna we're gonna see how this thing unfold, man. Now, he's predicting in August they gonna they they don't been in, they they'll probably been in charge. I think so too. So all here pretty 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 close pretty soon they gonna stick him with something, and we are gonna see how this thing really unfolds. Especially with them uh, coming up with this grand jury, uh, I, I, I it's gonna get serious. It's gonna get serious. 